Hello, I'm John Carroll, and I'm in the County Commissioner Chambers here at the Buncombe County Courthouse. And this is the room where public dialogue takes place. And one of the things that I believe as a county commissioner that I'd want to promote is public dialogue to be televised. The public portion of the county commissioner's meetings should be open, should be televised. People should be able to see and hear what's taking place in that public dialogue, public part of the meeting. Now, one of the things that I also firmly believe is, is that elected officials were elected to serve the people. If they aren't elected to serve the people, why are they here? And you can't serve the people without hearing the people. Now, some politicians I know in the past have believed that they're there only to speak to the people who elected them and not listen to them. But without that dialogue, that interaction between the people and the elected officials, there's no way to solve the problems. The problems are, of course, what you're elected to do. And you can't do that without dialogue. And one of the things that has developed in Buncombe County over the last few years is not enough listening and too much speaking. So one of the things that I want to do is to bring back more public comment. I'm a very patient person, and I enjoy listening to people. And I will enjoy listening to you and to your public comment. So let's all bring it back. Let's make government more transparent. Let's make government dialogue more easily attainable. One of the things that I would also like to suggest is to us to have our meetings in all the various communities around Buncombe County so that it would become easier, more cost effective for people to be able to attend a county commissioner meeting and be able to have some dialogue with the commissioners. And if the commissioners aren't, aren't in favor of that, then shame on the commissioners, simply because we need to make sure that everyone is heard and their, their, their views are expressed.